when you search your name online and Google and you don't show up anywhere and you're like, why am I not showing up? I filled out the Google business profile page, but I'm still not showing up. And so today I'm going to show you how you might have to get verified. And so there's lots of different ways. In the old days, you used to just do a, a mailer and it mailed it to you and you got verified. It was super easy, super simple. And now it is not so simple. And so today I'm going to show you and walk you through the things that you need to be able to do a video verification when you get video. And so sometimes this just happens that you have to do this. And so I have one that we're having to do, and I'm going to walk you through the process of what you need to do to be able to do this. Now, this is Jason Guyman with ChristmasLights.io. I help people start and grow Christmas light businesses and pressure washing businesses and all different kinds of businesses. So it doesn't matter what kind of business you're in. This will work with any of you trying to get your Google My Business or Google Business Profile up and running the very first thing is is you get here and you see that it says got a big thing right here big red thing that says you're not verified that means if you go over to your wherever you are and you search yourself in the maps here you will not find yourself over here in these maps no matter how much you do searching wise you know and nobody else can see you either and so this is why it is important that we get verified and so the first thing is is you can either type in my business you can type in whatever business that you have and this is where you will be able to type in just your business name now honestly it is best to do it with your phone if you do it with your phone you'll see that if you do it online you're going to have to do it on your phone anyway and it's going to take you to the same steps you do have to be a an, a person that is signed in in your gmail you do have to be signed in under the account of this gmail so that is something that you have to be signed into or otherwise you're not going to be able to see this and then you're going to click get verified sometimes it will verify like it'll say send a message send something and it'll just automatically do it you'll click maybe more options you have to send a video now i've heard if you try to redo it enough times sometimes it will go through but a lot of times it doesn't. So what do we need to do to verify it? We're going to click next. Your location should match your business profile exactly, right? So whatever is on your business profile that you have set up already needs to match the exact same thing. Your business name, the categories, all of this. So once you get done here, you go to next again. Now, this is where it's telling you to plan ahead, right? Now, this is not videotaping it on your phone and try to upload it here. You actually got to videotape this through the app. You And you'll see it coming up here that you have to do it through the app or otherwise it won't work. So you'll click here and you can hit, it says take your time, most successful. So you only, you got one to two minutes. And you're going to start outside capturing the business's surroundings first before moving inside. So you're going to want to see the name of the street. You want to try to get the name of the business, maybe have some keys going into the door, have your name on the door, right? These are all things that are going to help you to get here. So you're going to hit start recording. And again, you're going to see that you have to make sure that you're signed in. So I'm signed in as Guyman121. So you, obviously, if you tried to scan this, this is not going to get you in because you're not signed in as me. And so this is how you have to do that. Now, when you see, when I go to scan this QR code here, you're going to see that this is what pops up when you scan the QR code. So again, your location should match your business, you know, a street sign nearby businesses, your business name category should match your business profile, business intent, right? So all of this, you're basically going to hit next. And then you got to start recording to be able to try to see if this is going to work. So you got to allow your access to your camera and your microphone. You're going to hit next. You're going to allow the camera. And so you're going to have to go here. And then you are going to start recording your screen, right? So you're going to start recording all of the stuff that you have 
and you're going to show that this local signs and nearby businesses, the business category, the business exterior, show some of the products inside, the computers, the names, proof of management, unlocking the store entrance, operating payment tool, proof of address. So these are all the things. So once you get that done, you're going to see that the video that longer than 30 seconds are likely to more to get verified. So you have to do it. And then this is how you will send your video into Google. And so this is how you have to do this to try to get verified. So I know this can take some time. It can take some setting up. If you got business cards, if you can, you know, you don't want to show, you can show some of this stuff of, but like if, for instance, this, if you have Christmas lights, you're going to show Christmas lights. You're going to show the business inside there. You're going to show all of these details. So to show that you might show the lunchroom, you might show different things to help you get verified. But yes, you actually have to do this verification through the app. And so if you do the app on your phone, this is what you're going to have to do to get verified, to get your Google My Business or Google Business Profile verified. So I hope this helps you out. I know this can be confusing and sometimes you're ready to pull your hair out and it can be a pain in the butt, but this is how you can do this. Now, what I will say is if you are working out of your house, it's going to be harder, but you still need to get a sign. You get uh, a sign made, you get business cards made, you get signs put on your truck, you put signs on, you have your Christmas lights there. These are all things that you can do as the service side of things and try to get this done. So, hope this video has helped you out. Again, this is brought to you by ChristmasLights.io and I help people start and grow Christmas light businesses. See you in my next video.